beautiful Monday it is here in South Africa, ladies and gentlemen welcome to our channel. Where you will enjoy the news we are bringing to you. Firstly congratulations to the Springboks, well done boys you made us proud. Number 2 let's take a moment and talk about Lamontville Golden Arrows, second place on. The log and they are doing absolutely great. Yet you'll hear people talking about how Mabuthi can use and not having a certificate for. Coaching. If the need and the resources are provided for him he must get those credentials because. He is great. He has changed arrows to the better. Wow it's nice seeing such talent in the DSTV Premier League. They even won against Kaiser Chiefs on Saturday. Moving on let's talk about the African Football League. Why did one against Esperance, scoring only one goal that made a huge difference between the. Two clubs. And the South African champions Mamelodi Sundowns also scored the only goal last night in. Their encounter with the African giants Alali. There was lots of drama in that game. After the game we saw Marcel Kohler complaining about the penalty that he strongly believed they should have been given. He had a lot to say and this is some of the words he said. We have a chance to qualify and I believe the Cairo match will decide everything, the Swiss coach told reporters after the game. We will make every effort to win, especially since our fans will support us. We played a good first half defensively but lacked calmness. In the second half we conceded after an error sundowns are one of the best teams in. Africa and always compete for titles, we only have two days to prepare, but we will do. Everything we can. Having dominated African club football for decades, record 11-time champions Ali have. Vast experience to call upon. By playing up home advantage and talking up his team's pedigree, the coach has kept. Ali's hopes alive. Now they must walk the walk in Cairo to avoid AFL heartbreak and continue their quest for. More continental glory. For once I agree with the chairman of Chippy United on the VAR issue, we need it ASAP. During the day he released a statement asking Safa to take this VAR staff serious. Clubs are suffering because of wrong decisions. For a moment I thought he wanted to fire Mamila, thank god he didn't do that. Because coach Mamila has a good coach. We've reached the end of this video please like share and subscribe to my channel. Love you guys until next time peace.